Hello and welcome to Hamer Reviews. My name is Christopher Hamer and this is a review of the Lumi Body Clock Lux 750D. There's been quite a growth in popularity for such body clock or essentially LED lights that provide sunsets and sunrises for people that find it difficult to either fall asleep or get up in the morning. Essentially what these do is they use LED lights to simulate a sunrise or indeed a sunset. So they go from quite bright to quite dim, usually over a period of time. You can get various different types. You can get simple um, lights that simply uh, light up and um, then also uh, obviously give you the sun down um, with no other features, or you get uh, ones such as this that include features such as Bluetooth, um, wireless speakers, um, obviously DAB radio and USB inputs, etc. So you do have a lot of choice. This is probably at the top of the market. It costs around £200. It's quite a lot of money for one of these body clocks. Personally, I usually use a Wyvings Aura. Um, it's a similar kind of setup, though um, it's a little bit um, different in terms of how it looks. It's very much aims the light at you, um, but it also has a speaker integrated as well. This Lumi device is very nice. It looks great. It's got a lovely fabric cover for the um, speaker grill. You've got a very nice glass dome at the top um, and then a LED screen with the various controls. You get uh, one for volume, one to control the light, as well as various buttons to control the settings. The thing is though, I find this very complicated. The entire menu system isn't logically set out. So trying to actually set this up to um, either wake you up with the uh, sunrise or indeed to have the right kind of um, sunset was quite fiddly. I certainly had to refer to the manual and even then I wasn't 100% sure that I'd set it up correctly. Another thing I think about a lot when I look at this is that although the materials look nice, it doesn't feel particularly high quality. It's actually fairly light. And the reason for that, I think, is that the speaker system in this is quite cheap. It's a bit of a shame because it's such a premium product. You'd feel that they might have put a better speaker in here so you could use it as a wireless speaker for your phone properly um, rather than having a separate speaker in your room. But really, this speaker isn't great at all. It doesn't have any base that I can tell, and even the highs and mid-range sounded quite muddled. In addition, if you want to listen to radio, you need to extend most of this aerial, which is huge, um, in order to get a good signal. Now, with a lot of DAB radios, you can actually get them nicely integrated into the unit, and it would have been nice to see Lumi doing so. The thing I think that would have made this better is if Lumi had actually integrated the settings into the app. That's one thing that Wyvings did really well with Aura. It allowed you to control the entire unit from an app, meaning you could set your alarm, you could choose sleep sounds, which this also has, um, with ease. As a result of it being so complex to use, I actually find it difficult to recommend this. It is a lot of money. 200 pounds for one of these lights is not cheap. And yes, it can help those with, um, SAD, uh, so people who find it difficult to deal with the dark winter months. But realistically, there are more choices for less money out there, and I'd probably recommend you go for one of those instead. Another thing that I think they, they probably could have improved is the actual LED display they've used. Um, it's quite a cheap and basic one. It would have been nice to have a crisp OLED screen. Um, Revo do that really well on their radio, so it's a shame they didn't integrate something similar here. Um, and also, I found that the actual range of light that you get from these, although good, um, actually felt better with some of the competitors, especially the sunrise in the morning. Um, but it does work. I mean, the light does work. I'm not saying that this doesn't work. I'm just saying that for the money, I don't think it's good value. So that's what I think of the Lumi Body Clock Lux 750D. Um, probably an acceptable choice if you have money to spend and don't mind wasting it, but you may want to shop around for some alternatives um, if you're a little more price conscious. 
Thank you very much for watching. If you have any questions, please do pop them in the comments and I'll come back to you as always. Also, if you uh, hit thumbs up, that'd be very much appreciated and do consider subscribing. Thanks very much for watching and I hope to see you again next time. Goodbye.